Shropshire-based Lindstrand Technologies has created an array of innovative inflatable products, one of which is the AV Dome. The AV Dome is an interesting one. With the four cameras, you can have a complete 360 seamless picture. What's a bit unique with it is that you can be inside and outside of view it. Therefore, it has dual use. And that is a balance of the coating in the fabric. So half of the light gets caught on the inside, half goes through. And that took a bit of work to get that right, but that really is very, very effective now. The AV dome currently on the factory floor is for a client in Dubai. We're actually using two different materials in this construction. The base section, which is the air cell structure, um, has to be a higher strength fabric purely because it contains operating air pressure of around 1 psi, which almost feels as if you're touching a piece of concrete. It's that, it's that sort of uh, hardness and feeling to it and strength-wise. The single skin on the, on the main dome is a weaker fabric. It's a woven fabric initially with a, a layer of PVC that's drawn across the top of it. And it's just the, due to the thickness of that layer that allows the light to pass through it. And obviously, the thicker the layer of, of the PVC, uh, the less it allows light. So what we have to do is find a PVC fabric that can give us uh, the best performance for both internal and external projection. Once the dome's been constructed, it's time for a test inflation, which requires a lot of space. In this case, the old shipyard at Birkenhead. As a production manager, this is my opportunity to test it 100% and all the systems 100% before shipping it out to the customer. So the guys at the moment are inflating the base section, um, which is the main supporting structure. Once the main base section is actually um, up and operating at pressure, which is approximately 1 psi, We'll then start uh, increasing the air volume in the centre of the building, which inflates the main uh, audio visual dome. The single skin projection dome takes 90 minutes to inflate. By being inside the building, once it's inflated, you can hear typically when there's air that leaks out like a car tyre or a bike tyre, you get a hissing noise and there isn't any, or wouldn't appear to be any at the moment, um, so that's quite good. The final part of the process is the installation of access doors, which also act as ballast. Uh, we need to put this one on, on the revolving door from the far side, uh, and then that's it, uh, we'll be complete. Um, as far as the inflation itself and the integrity of the structure is concerned, everything's gone really well. Control systems for the inflation fans are working. Um, there's been no structural damage. Um, there's no leaks that are obvious to us. So we're very happy with everything. The only thing that we can't test is the projection system, which the customer typically does. So the dome's now ready for use with 360-degree projections at parties and events worldwide.